right, welcome to Survivor 46 Fan Therapy Week 8. Charlie Fan, what are you doing? Eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. Oh, we're playing hide and seek. I will give you five bucks if you help me. This is so dumb. Ten. Ten? Seriously? You know, this isn't a rice negotiation. Fine. Found you. Oh, come on, that's targeting. Oh, shut up and take your L. Hunter showboated his challenge skills all episode, and when Tevin left, he completely did nothing at Tribal Council. Let's see what happens next week when he doesn't have his number one ally. Which was because of Venus, by the way. Crud! This is why we need to vote the Venus fan out. Crap! Oh, please. Princess Venus easily got rid of Soda. She can also get rid of Tevin, and she can get rid of Hunter, she can get rid of Tiff, she can get rid of Q if she really wanted to. She could even get rid of Charlie the Cat and the real life- Is that the Q fan? I was about to quit anyway, but you foolish fools, you've given me everything I need to know in this little game of hide and seek. Charlie fan, you can't even win a game of hide and seek unless you're asking for help. Venus fan and Tevin fan, your overconfidence betrays you. And Liz fan, I knew the minute I saw you, you're lying low, but you're ready to scoop up this game, put on your back, and make a run at it to the end. I'm on to you. I mean, look, can you blame Liz? Tevin and Hunter branched out at the merge and left her behind. Yeah, uh-huh. Uh-huh, that's really interesting, Liz fan. Oh, and Tiff is right there, and she has an idol. Can we please just vote him out? Ha! Not before I vote out the Tevin fan. All this to almost quit? Please make it make sense. Is that everyone? Yeah, only seven people were playing. Um, <coughs> I said seven, not several. Get out! You're just jealous. Jelinski's a legend. 